everybody. In this tutorial, I'll be how to make a basic hair texture. So as you can see, we have a box here, and all you do to get that is you go new, then make your values 256 by 256. Usually hair icons are that. Then you hit OK. Then we need to select what color hair we want. And we will make ours brown. So we start with our basic background. And then we'll go layer, new layer. And move our color palette over a little bit darker. Select our brush, and on the new layer, we will make lines going up and down. They don't have to be perfect. We're going to mess them up later. Lines everywhere, or you can make them perfect. Then we'll go noise. Spread. And we will raise all the values all the way up. And it makes little dots. And I usually repeat it so it makes them all over the place. Then we'll go filters, blur, motion blur. We'll make the length 60, and the angle 90. And that makes little strands of hair. I usually make a few of these layers, some lighter, lighter than the original background and some darker, so we'll make another layer. And we'll make this one lighter. And we'll do the same thing. Line. Filters. Noise. Spread. OK. If you want some thicker strands, a good trick is just to do it once. Motion blur. Okay. You see, starting to make more. And then we'll go a little bit lighter. Layer. New layer. Okay. And we'll do it once more. Let's lighten it a little bit. This one will make a little bit. Filters, noise, spread, and we'll spread them once more. We'll go filter, motion blur. And you can do this as many times as you want. But there you see we start to have a basic strand. Then what you can do is make a new layer, change it to the circle fuzzy brush, and raise the size, I don't know, we can do 20. And make a couple, oh, I'm sorry, change the color to white. And we can make a couple lines. This will be our shine on the hair. And we go filters, draw some blur, raise this up a little bit. And 
creates a little bit of shine. I want it a little bit thicker shine, so we'll, we'll repeat the Gaussian blur. So we go normal, overlay. And if you want more blur, you can duplicate that layer by hitting this little duplicate button. Makes it brighter. Then we'll give the hair a little bit of depth. We'll go new layer. And select the black. When you do your hairs, usually the top is closest to the head and the bottom is the ends of the hair, the bottom. And we'll just make a little bit of black right here. And we'll go filters. Blur, Gaussian Blur, raise that value up to about 60. And that'll make it so that the hair coming out of the head looks a little bit darker. If you want to make the strands at the end of the hair a different color, you can change it and we'll just make this a really light red. And we will make a new layer. Change our size lower. Brush and just draw a little bit down here. And we will do what we did before. Filters dialog, noise, spread. I'll just do it once for this one. And then we'll do it again. Fil filters, blur, motion blur. You can see it makes the tips a different color. You can duplicate that layer to make it a little bit darker. And that's a basic hair texture. Thank you for viewing my tutorial. If you have a second, please visit my shop. My shop. Again, my name is Chill Shock. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you very much.